Hi, good afternoon. I'm Ben from Ebony and Ivory Motors. Today I'm going to show you around this 2015 64 plate Saya Alhambra 2 litre TDI uh, manual 6 speed transmission eco, uh, eco motive iTech specification. Finished off in Notche metallic pearl blue. Only two previous keepers on the V5 document and HPI report and a fully comprehensive service history. I believe there's 10 entries on the service record for this vehicle. Has had the timing belt and water pump replaced as well. Uh, we'll detail the dates and mileage as of the service history in the text of the advert. Uh, comes complete with two keys, V5 document, original book pack and paperwork. Just arrived in stock with ourselves, so we'll go through our own uh, VAG specialist workshop which is also RAC approved for another service and MOT as required. So let's quickly buzz around it once, very quickly. Then we'll have a look at the car in more detail so you can get a better understanding of what we're offering. And also we do use these videos to prep from. So they are brutally honest. But all in all, a very, very tidy example. So let's start off at this near side front corner, work our way up and down the panel work from front to rear. So near side front wing, good. Near side front door's good, the rear door's good, and the back quarter is good. So no cosmetic work required down that near side of the vehicle. Alloy some light scuff marks to the outer edge, to be honest does let it down so refinish that uh, as soon as possible please. A couple of, uh, I'm going to say light marks but most of them are water marks. There's a little chip just there to touch in, make sure it's the correct colour blue please. Near side rear alloy, a couple of little marks just to touch in on there tire again is a good four or five millimeters plus another look up and down from this angle nothing missed down that near side tiny in fact there's a tiny parking thing in this near side rear quarter so don't guy to lift that please and then it is completely straight down there very very tiny though come around the rear bumper no major scuffs or scrapes. A couple of light marks on it, just given the age uh, and mileage of the vehicle and what it is used for people jumping in and out of the back. So some very light marks. Probably worth us putting a texture loading strip on there when it goes in for prep, please. No damage to the tailgate or rear light clusters. Rear screen looks good and up along the roof again is all good okay let's do the same down the off side of the vehicle starting off this time at the rear quarter and work our way forwards off side rear quarters good doors good and the front door and wing are also good alloy in good condition light mark just to touch in just there tyre four or five millimetres of tread plus they're all Avon tyres as well so the premium tyres alloy just some light marks to touch in on the alloy there uh, four or five mil on that tyre as well bit of polish okay nothing missed down that off side of the vehicle Come around the front bumper, no nasty scuffs or scrapes. A couple of light marks, just given the age and mileage of the vehicle again, nothing major. Front fogs are good, front headlamps are good, and the bonnet looks in good order as well. All the grills are all good, chrome works good. Maybe the odd light stone chip, but I can't really see 
anything on there to point out. Huge front windscreen in good condition. One tiny chip there, but too small to have even uh, damaged the screen or any repair required. More white polish to take off. Shows it's been polished. Be better off the car though, so when it gets recleaned. Uh, interior, factory standard. Gotta say, a very, very clean, tidy Alhambra. Normally they're quite well used, but this is in exceptionally good condition. Uh, the seats and the stitching and the bolsters and the padding is all good. No odours of any cigarettes and no odours of any pets or dogs. So, all good. No entry exit marks to the handles in the rear. Uh, five individual seats. ISO fix fit into this whole row of uh, seats there, all individual. Uh, all got headrests as well. Captain style uh, trays to play with for the kids in the back. Light grey headlining, again all in good condition. Looks to have climate control aircon in the rear as well. Rarity that it's actually got its uh, luggage privacy cover in place there. That can be removed if two people are sat in the rear. Just to see the base, is there actually ISOFIX seats in the rear as well? So five seats, all ISOFIX fitting. I've learned something new today. Okay, some carpet mats, if they're for this car, it's a bonus. Those two seats do fold flat down to create a large boot space if you'd rather have that than the two seats and all three point belts in the rear as well. Good looking car. Looks to have privacy glass from the B pillar backwards as well. Right, let's jump in, run you through the mileage and spec mileage. 42,854 miles. Push button start. Electronic parking brake switch needs replacing on this one. Let's turn that down so we've ordered one of those from Seat. That'll be fitted. We've got a DAB stereo. Media streaming, telephone, Bluetooth and navigation. All the buttons fully functioning. Park Pilot, well that's what it's called in Volkswagen world, but front and rear parking sensors with optical uh, display and acoustic sound front and rear. Dual climate control aircon. Six speed box, has got an auto hold handbrake. Uh, original book pack, cruise control, a leather bound multifunctional steering wheel. Auto lights, electronically heated adjustable mirrors and full electric windows. Right, there we go. Any questions, give us a call. Thank you very much. Cheers. Bye-bye.